first thing, I'm gonna just pull it in. You can see the tractor moving. The disc is moving a little bit too. <laughs> this is getting colder than this. The hydraulics on this kind of suck. That might be really close for that, that one. Actually too close. Went too far. So, I used almost the whole top link here to pull it in. Um, so, <laughs> don't really want to get in that situation. Obviously, a little bit closer would have made it easier, but you see how I don't have to pick this up and I don't have to kick these or anything like that. It should just be really easy to put this on by yourself as long as you can pull in fairly straight. So now I'm going to swap the disc for the Perfecta and then we're going to go over to the Springfield because I kind of like the Perfecta better um, and might as well use it. So here we go. when you're on like a level surface. What about this one? Yeah, that was pretty easy too. If I can get the pin out. So, no problem with the disc. The disc is generally pretty easy to take on and off. That's already ready too. So, this should be pretty easy to put back on when I want to move it. simple didn't even need to adjust sometimes if you're on an angle or whatever you're gonna have to twist it in and out and slide it off um, just gonna leave that down usually I have chain here but I'm just going right there so moving over Okay, so I'm on the tractor. I'm gonna try to back up with the camera holding it, um, but show you how all you gotta do is just line up fairly straight and then you just use the top link like we showed earlier. But you know, you don't have to be a guru, just back up kind of straight. because I'm trying to use the camera but just because I can stick it in there 
does not mean that I want to do that. I need to move over like a whole foot. pretty good this one's gonna have to go it's gonna move out but um it should be fine so this is a good example we're pretty far away the other side is already on what are we gonna do am i gonna move this in that looks really hard. So we just, hopefully this is zoomed in and can see. So I'm just tightening the top link here. You should see a pretty dramatic shift there. And look. There we go. And then you gotta go actually back the opposite way, which is extending it to slide it all the way on. But look, no muscling around, just easy. All right, good morning everybody. Standing with the case and the Perfecta here. Just wanted to make a little intro into what I was just doing. I was putting on the implement. I was showing exactly how I do it, how it probably should be done. I've seen it taught, in my opinion, very wrong. And I just demonstrated how to do it with one hand and <laughs> holding the camera and not having to muscle it around at all. So, Hopefully that's helpful and, you know, the proof is in the pudding. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know if that's a real saying. Hopefully the proof is just as it's shown that it's pretty simple to do with one arm. You don't have to muscle it around or kick it with your steel toe boots or anything like that. And it's still pretty fast. You know, I showed that with the camera, holding the camera. Um, so hopefully that demonstration is valuable to people and good luck.